Hello everyone, this is Mansi from Evitati Dodge and now we are starting with question number 1, exercise 3.3. So in this question we have given a parallelogram ABCD. So ABCD is a parallelogram here. Complete each statement along with the definition or property used. Now you have to complete parts of complete parts and you have to mention what we have used in this case, which property is used. So the first one is AB equals to AD means this. Now this is equal to this one that is BC. Now what property we use? How do we know that this is equal to this? Because in a parallelogram, opposite sides are equal. Right? Then next we have angle DCB. Angle D. C, B means this full angle. So this angle will be equal to again opposite. Angles are also equal. So this will be equal to angle D, A, B. The reason being opposite angles are equal. Right? Next we have OC equals to, OC kitna hai yaha se leke yaha tak. So this one will be equal to OA. Why? Because hume pata hai jo parallelogram ke diagonals hote hai, they are bisectors. So this means OC will be equal to OA because diagonals bisect each other. And bisect means ke wo equal part mein se cut karta hai. Last part we have measure of DAB. DAB means DAB. So this angle plus measure of angle CDA. CDA means this angle. So this angle and this angle. In dono ka sum kya hoga? The sum of these two angles will be 180 degree. Why? Because parallelogram mein jo mai pas adjacent angles hote hain. They are supplementary. Supplementary means their sum is 180 degree. So adjacent angles are supplementary. So that's why in dono ka sum 180 degree hoga. So this was question number 1. Now let's come to the next question.